Hey, what's up, guys? It's Owen Finch here, the Wrestling Fortune Champion, and I'm here to give you my WWE Raw review. Now, this Raw was very uneventful. Nothing really clicked to me except for one thing, probably. Okay, let's. So, first thing I have for was Mick Foley segment. Actually, wasn't expecting Mick Foley to be there. Um. So we have him come out and saying he's gonna going to find a permanent general manager, he's going to call from the board of directors, pretty much saying how um, he's going to be uh, the general manager of both Raw and SmackDown this week, and he made a match with CM Punk and Sheamus versus Daniel Bryan and Kane, so, and then he uh, had John Myers come out and um, fans were booing him, and um, he made a match, between. he said before he, um, he was done being the general manager, he made a match between him. David Otunga and Big Show versus John Cena. Um, and then he left. So yeah, pretty one of them right there. Except Big Foley coming out, I was surprised to see him. Then we had Sheamus and CM Punk versus Kane and Daniel Bryan. Why bother? Why bother reviewing this stuff? It's just gonna be negative. Like, why bother? Yeah, Punk and Kane won. If I go to sleep, it was a pretty decent match. I don't even know what. No, no, full kick. And CM you know, Punk landed on his feet, and everyone else goes on the ground right away. Even Chris Jericho. But why bother? I could review other stuff. I can review TNA. I could review Win of Honor. I could review Top Four Promotions like I did before. I could review, oh, I don't know, anything but this pretty much. Why am I still... I'm surprised I'm still watching this. I'm just watching this just to know what happens. Make it the pay-per-views. Like I said, last pay-per-view was a decent pay-per-view, except there was stuff I would have done differently. Like tonight's Raw. So why am I bothering? So I just end this video. I'm gonna just kind of skip around. That AJ. Well, I don't really get what they're doing with AJ. Then that Jack Swagger and Dolph Ziggler saying how. Swagger who's better, and it was obvious who's better, it's Jack Swagger who's better, no, no, it's Dolph Ziggler who's better, so Dolph Ziggler gonna beat Jack Swagger by the zigzag. Oh, man. And they had, uh, Brock Lesnar's answer, this is something good to cover. Um, I knew Paul Heyman was gonna be out there, um, Paul Heyman said no, I was actually thought they were gonna say yes, but I think this is a better storyline. Then Triple H comes out saying Brock Lesnar won't bite me, um, he wants to go down as a quitter, and then, um, Paul Heyman says, you're trying to change my mind, you're not the big, you're not the wrestling, you're not a wrestler no more, you're now a business fan, pretty much he said, and, um, um, then he said, um, oh yeah, then he said, um, that, you know, every move, then he, then he mentioned, like, his, he mentioned his wife, um, he mentioned, um, pretty much everyone, then, um, Paul Heyman went to um, hold him. He was like choking me. Like, I like he saw that way. I was like, you're choking me, you're choking me. Then Paul Heyman was like, I know every move you're going to make before, before you even make it. Then he just punched him and he was like, you didn't see that coming, did you? Tell Brock Lesnar, I'd see him at SummerSlam if he accepts. Then he leaves the ring and then they go to help Paul Heyman. But then we have other matches. Let's get to the other matches. Um... Alberto Rio vs. Santino squash match that we went by Cross Armbreaker and then uh, Ricardo when he gets to Santino Morella feud still continuing I don't know why um, then we had Sydney segment um, pretty pointless six toe right Piper came out he made it a bit interesting then we had um, he played to get hit over the head with the um, record uh, Prima Nautico vs. Tyler Sonio Daily Nun Tyler Sonio Daily Nun left for some odd reason then we had John Lowe and I's big, oh, big short in fight, um, we have a, David Otunga walked away during the match, and then Cena gave him three FUs and wins the match. Um, so why bother? My interest in this company is not that big as it used to be anymore. I am still very much a wrestling fan, I'm more into TNA now. TNA, 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 TNA. WWE is doing nothing right now. This is like, a year ago I was more into WWE. Now I'm more into TNA, it's just gonna... No, maybe that's why I'm not into WWE anymore. Maybe... I don't know. WWE's going 
going the wrong direction right now. There was no Intercontinental Championship, WWE Championships, not main eventing. John Cena's is now just kind of going to get thrown around. Um, what the heck? I want my Stone Cold DVD so I can review that. But nope, that's not going to happen. I left it at my friend Steve's house. I just had to do that. Would have gotten a review. And I could have been watching this DVD right now. And maybe this DVD. And maybe this DVD. And maybe this one. But nope, that didn't, ha that didn't happen. Well, it has to be a complete waste of time. Why am I bothering watching that company? See you later.